yes, this is finally starting. I just uh, played a little bit of different games until it was starting. About the homepage, these features will help you enjoy dueling to the fullest. Duel battle with duelists from all over the world. You can also switch it up and duel according to different rules. Deck, check your decks and adjust them as you like. Solo, practice your strategies or read the stories behind the cards. Shop, get new cards by purchasing card packs, etc. Okay. To commemorate the game's release, we're currently having a special gem sale. Check out the exclusive purchase. Each player can purchase up to three. Let's check them at least. I just want to check how you purchase uh, gems. I'm not purchasing any. This is going to be free to play, right? I could play, uh, write this in the title. Um, free to play journey and finished. Good. Now let's check. 11.99 for um, 1500 and this one is 28.99 for 3500. Okay. Am I able to? Yes, I'm able to scroll. This is how you buy packs. Interesting numbers. 23.99. All right. I just wanted to check. This is how you buy gems. If you are interested in it, I'm not the guy, right guy to go for this. Survey regarding gameplay. Our survey to improve gameplay is currently open for submissions. Let us know how we can make Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel better for you. We look forward from hearing, to hearing from you. Yes, I'm actually interested. And I already have some ideas, so yeah. Am I going to... Okay, are you enjoying dueling? It's a little unfair if I, I'm already doing this. Whatever. Do you feel do you understand how to do how to duel? I understand. You know what I think in this regard. What do you think of a background music? That's actually really good. This background music is actually really epic. I like it. Really good. What do you think of the pacing and the animations that appear? I think that's mediocre. I think it should be better. Uh, what do you think of a dual controls? Right now I'm thinking they are pretty alright, but I'm not sure. Maybe also mediocre you find difficult about the controls, please let us know. Seeing the cards, the cards on the field are hard to select. A little bit, I would say, I have a hard time seeing browsing the card selection list. Yes. Uh, are hard to select, I have a hard time seeing the cards in the extra deck, graveyard and the banish. It's a little weird, but I don't... F yes, I f no for now not. The cards in the are hard to select. This might be a problem, but for now I don't think so. I think it's hard to switch phases. I, f I find it hard to read the dual log. How to bring up a dual log are uh, hard to read. I think for now that's okay. Mandatory, are you enjoying solo mode? I'm ha I don't know. Um, I guess. How was the difficulty of solo mode? I'm just doing this right now. Are you enjoying dueling with loner decks? Do you feel the dueling in solo mode gives you a good grasp of the unique features of each dual deck archetype? You know what? I may just do this, will not be saved, are you sure you want to exit? Yes, I I, I just, I, I can't just do, do this without knowing what the game's features are. I will do this once I have an idea of what to do. New cards are available in the shop, new structure decks are available in the shop, new accessories, dual passes now available in the shop. Okay, nice to know. Oh, and I'm going to, oh, and also I don't see the shell anymore, I didn't even notice. Okay, I mean it's still empty, but whatever. Uncover and this. Let's go to the shop. I hope this is about the shop. You can purchase card checks. Yes, pack, structure. Also, I have to press on these arrows. I don't like that. There should be also a touching uh, area where I could just touch it. Whatever. Dual pass. Also interesting that they have a pot of greed, but I guess why I get why. 1000 gems currently. Uh, master pack. New legendary stats from here. Open the whole new world. Blue eyes, junk, stardust, and code talker strengthen your deck. Stalwart Force, a must-have for when you have want to get... Let's see. What do we have? Ultra Rare, Ultra Rare. Eldritch, interesting. Super Rare. Super Rare. What else? Highlight. Also very nice look. Details, Orts, Limited. Normal Pack, Secret Pack, no Bonus Pack. Okay, Structure Deck. Magicians of Panel, and what are we getting? I want to see the actual structure contents. This one. Okay, yeah, 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 okay. I basically have to buy three of those, so... Ah, uh, three already. 500, so I already only have... Yes, I have to buy it, of course. Um, do I have the... 
for now we don't buy anything. Notifications. Notification. What uh, what are the notifications? This is still the start, so of course I have a lot of notifications. Yes, probably I am. Yes. Thank you for playing. Survey. I am going to do the survey soon enough. This one, data transfer. Special missions. Missions. Let's just start the missions. I don't... It's a little overwhelming to start a new game. Log in on account. 1000. Okay. 20. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's good. This also resolves a lot of my problems. Mission rewards. Unlimited missions. Yeah. Okay. And why are there still three missions left? What three missions? One mission. Okay. Unlimited. Claim all rewards at once, I think. Gems 300. 500. Okay. Still missions. What's going on? Please. Okay, the missions are gone. So, notifications are still. Let's just go to solo, please. I just want to play the game. I just want to play the game. About solo mode. Uncover the hidden stories of the cards and dual and decks built for drawing out your potential. Learn how to pilot each deck. About solo mode. And. Okay, nice. So, we are going. We have finished the tutorial dual strategy. Learn how to special, uh, summon special summon special monsters and other useful techniques for duels. Completely stupid, but we are just going to do it because... Okay. Duel. Okay, that's the law. My deck, starting deck, clear war. Oh, right, Jackie. Okay. We do get um, good rewards. I like that. I like it. Connecting. Yep. It rewards you for playing the solo ward. That's good. Rewards are important in a game like this. Duel. Okay. Uh, depending on... Yep. And this is a good way of uh, using types, tip screens. You are able to skip them if you want to. I think this is a little annoying. The uh, way of setting them is weird. Um, 1600. If this card builds a non effect monsters, I think I will have to do it in attack position. If I have things like this, Shield Crush, it's not good enough in the third. I mean, it's good in my second turn. Dragon Arm. Call of the Haunted, Memory of the Advance. Atlas. Uh, when an opponent's monster declares an attack, no. Tribute 1, no. Not now. A list of squad and this card. When you take damage equal to, and if you do banish that monster during the end phase uh, of your opponent's next turn, special summon to your side of the thing. That's actually pretty alright for now. Activate. Also, the snippet in the uh, lower parts is actually me uh, uh, showing showing me that it's a, a set card. I like it. Draw face. Now we're actually starting. Good, good, good. We have this Ipper World Chalice. I will normal summon it to this position. This card, Call of the Haunted. I don't have anything in defense, but in it, any, anything. Also, defense. Okay, whatever, whatever. Fine. Nope, I will also activate the effect of Ballista Squad because I don't want to have this card open in the open. So, yep, confirm. Nope, and end my turn. Now I have Call of Haunted targets in attack position, so it's not a good target. Whatever, we have this Hunted Dragon. Good, I'm going to take the damage. Yep. If this card battles a no. Okay, it's a normal move. Okay, okay, okay. Face up, attack position. Yep. This is Komori Dragon. And now I have this. Skill successor. Set in defense. Uh, set in attack. And end my turn, I guess. Okay, slowly but surely. I am learning how to use it. Whatever, another one of those. Is this until the, uh, dur until the end of his turn? Good. So, damage step. The opponent declared damage. I want to wait just to test it out. Yes, this is the damage step. So, okay. Okay, so confirm. A1900. 200 damage for my opponent. He's at 63, I'm at A61. I could go for this. I think I'm going to activate Call of the Hunt to get this Ip back, I think. Into defense position. I mean, it's in attack position, but I will be able to change it into defense position on my turn. Draw Ballista Squad, good. Um, it's making use of my cards, so okay. This card, I could go for this. Non-effect monsters you control gain 500 attack. Also, all effect monsters your opponent control. Lose 500 if this card is destroyed, you can target. That's a good card. How much attack does it have? 1400. 
Not good enough currently, but it's alright for later. I also have the option of... Uh, is this my graveyard? No, that's the that effect. This is my graveyard. Why does my graveyard look like this? That's... I don't like that. I don't like that. Whatever. Activate skill successor. And get rid of the his monster. Attack. Main phase 2. I'm interested in uh, sacrificing this card either by Link Summoning or by uh, Bliss Squad. I think on this turn I'm probably going to sacrifice this card. Oh, he's setting. So for now I'm not going to activate anything. I have the Shield Crush, so Shield Crush does target one defense position, monster destroy their target. Yep. Yep, those animations are a little slow. I think you could make them faster. Is this uh, on? Auto? Okay. I don't know what this specifically does. Whatever, we are just going to attack, battle phase, and attack. Slowly but surely. I think uh, a thing that I don't know whether or not I like it is the fact that we already have link monsters. We already have all the cards. So I might have, it might have been more interesting if we made it like dual links where we made a reset. But I guess I know why, where we're coming from because this isn't supposed to be a game like dual links. Well, you are trying to change the pace from the game. You are instead trying to play the game um, in a way um, that's online. You are trying to make an online portal that's from Konami itself. That's important. It's not like Duel Links. And I do have to make the distinction very clear. Very clear. Important. So we have different options. I think I'll just go for this Kachi Kochi Dragon. Because now this card is um, getting a little too dangerous for me. Uh, I mean, my opponent is getting too dangerous. So, Kachi Kochi Dragon. And end my turn. Also, I didn't play Hearthstone in my life. But I think this looks pretty similar to it, right? I mean, from the layout. Not from, you know, but it has similar layouts like Hearthstone, I think. Like this end turn. Why is it a hexagon? And why is this a circle? Why not make it like all the uh, typical uh, Yu-Gi-Oh stuff? W okay, whatever. We have this Blade Knight. And yep. Tag, tag. And go for 20 hundred. Final blow. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Slowly but surely. Okay. And we get a little bit of experience. I'm going to also, we get Dry Jackie, what do we get from here? Come on, Harpy's Feather Duster, come on! Okay, Monster Reborn, also not bad. So, I want to go for, I did. Tr I will do this more, but I want to do different things. Survey, Dual Life, watch now, Sail and Away, Selection Pack, Survey, Dual Pass. I think this one you uh, have to buy for it, right? Uh, there's a free version and a... Uh, a gold version, so you have to buy the gold version, I think. Interesting. Missions, notifications. I think in solo there should be a uh, duel against worldwide. Dual strategy, the absolute monarch. The warriors of the six elemental lords. Is this back in elemental lords to the field? Use emperor spell cards. Learn how to summon special summon. Nope. Where do you duel against other people? This is my deck. Create powerful strategies, collect new cards and items. This right here, replay, data, edit. I'm Black Dog, this is my ID. Zero followers, zero following, beginner duelist. I guess I have to play a few car, a few, a few um, matches, so. I am really interested in buying a few. You know what, I'm going to buy one pack from Star Wars. Oh, that's how it works, so. Structure decks first. I want to buy three of those. 500. Yep, 500. Yep, 500. Yep. That's important. And now I have three of those. Recontract, three times remaining. Oh, you are actually limited to. Uh, oh, nope. Limitless structure contents. So that's interesting. Oh, Astrotopia is in this card, nice. In this uh, deck, okay, Zexal Construction, all right. I'm not, I don't care about that. <laughs> Search for a product, there's not any products that I want to have right now. 
This card has War Sword, so I will go a little bit into this deck. 1000, you know what? 1000. How is the pack opening? Okay, it's like this. Okay. Okay. Is this the best card? Okay, it's like this. So we get Lyrilus, Bird Call, Sphere Corripo, Rope of Edemium, Magna Rocket. Okay, that's good. For low play, for slow play, it's actually really good. Photon Hand, Dragon Mate, Leopard. Nice. Second one. This one. It's slow. It's a little too slow. It's too slow. It's too slow. I can't skip this animation, so no, it's not good. The Chronograph. Ah, hello, my old friend. Okay, and shang -Chi, that's good. We get this good old armor tricks for bear, for starters, okay. Already a pendulum deck ready. I already am able to play a better pendulum deck than normally, okay. Also, I like this altar guys, Chris from Rosenix, Lurulus Bird Call, Wall of Destruction, Servant of Endymion, okay. Parallel Exit, we need three of those if we want to play a good link. Okay, let's see. Okay, Sky Striker, Lyrilus, Twin Twister, that's good, Phantom Knight's Fork Blade, Dragon Mage, Twin Headed Thunder Dragon, Salamon Great, Photon Hand, another one. Okay, any good ones? Hey, ho those are the holos, if, if I'm correct. Holo Falls, Holo Foils, okay, Dried from Nova, yes. Uh, Dried from Gamma Eld, uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, Crystron Rosenix also good for Crystron Strat. I'm not playing Crystron in this version. Oh, a Ball Sword, nice. We have a Ball Sword and we have Twin Twisters. I basically could stop now, but since I already elected to do 10 packs, I'm not able to stop. So, three more. So, yep. Still a little too slow, whatever. Maybe I, sometimes I think it's alright. This one, when it opponents, all monsters, I think this is a good battle trap, so I think I will put it into my deck soon enough. Um, open. Okay, we got a good link, uh, uh, rank 3. Geonated Traverser, this link cannot be destroyed by opponent's card effects, that's already good. Two monsters, oh, that's pretty alright. Invoke Raijin, Construct, um, Wall of Disruption, Sphere Corribo. Elixir. Okay. We get another big pack, I guess. Okay. I like it more the, the way they did it in Duel Links, but whatever. Shang Sheng. Uh, Shang Sheng. Xiang Sheng, I think. Invoker of Madness. Different types, different attributes. Two of them. Okay. Invoke Raijin. One more Invoke in an LA star, and I could play it. Nice. So, what do we have here? Um, okay, Phantom. Oh, not bad, not bad. One enemy controller, a good enemy, a good staple in Duel Links. Wonder Magician, Spiritual Swords once per attack during your opponent's turn. This turn, you can pay 1,000. That's actually good. Spiritual Swords in this format, still in the beginning, especially. That's good. New card pack. I don't know how this works. So, Roaring Thunder, Shot Through Fiction, get powerful cards that fit with specific themes from secret part card packs. Do you want to go Shot Through? Wait, no. Oh, this is how it works. Okay. Counter Swing Mages. Is Astrograph banned right here? I think so. So, I don't know whether I want to go. Futuristic cards. I have to. Okay, I don't have any money, so yeah, secret pack, counter swing mages, but I will get it 23 hours left. Missions, still in the beginning, I am able to get a lot of uh, those those things, a lot of, you know, this, 1100, so I'm able to buy it. Now, okay, shops, secret packs, that's how it works, interesting. Interesting, they uh, make good use of this, um, okay, it's, you get all of those, interesting. Technical power, technical power, okay, interesting. Indomitable Knight, so you are able to go for Phantom Knights, okay. So, I think Astrograph is... Astrograph, okay, okay, it's not banned. And I'm able to, okay. 10 packs, purchase. We won't ask any questions, just take it. Just take my money. 
I mean, it's not my money, you know, like my gems. Oh, oh. Amazing pendulum, magician of hope. All right, yes. Special summon. All right, all right. Not too good, not too bad, I guess. And more of those. Lecter, okay. Sayuja's shackles, interesting. Okay, star pendulum graph, good. Pendulum call, good. Nirvana high paladin, good. Uh, no, Nirvana high paladin, I don't care about that. So, um, red dragon ninja, okay, okay. Stargazer, all right. Pendulum back, pendulum switch is good. Pendulum switch. This one I don't really care for. Pendulum hold. So, next one. Pendulum strategy is already mostly complete. Parametal first, metal first, one fusion monster. I don't care about metal first. A Blackwing, Hamatan, the dust, Parasect. Okay. Timebreaker, that's good. Black Fang, that's really good. And four of those keys. I have no idea what they mean. So, okay. Okay, we get a, an ultra ray, I think. This is how it works. So, what's my ultra ray going to be? I don't want to actually see it, okay? Speed ride passenger. Okay. They just open it for me. Dragunity Ascalon. One Dragunity, so, okay. Tuning Magician, also really important. Okay, next one. Okay, I think this is a super rare slot, I guess. Rainbozo, eight, an 8, okay. Okay, okay. Dragon Pit, good, good, good. Pendulum Halls, good. Okay. Uh, we have three Sky Arrows, so I already am able to build a somewhat good deck. No, wait, I don't have any Ordice monsters yet. Double Iris, important. Important. Next. I think we have three left. I'm not going to directly go to Panel, I hope. But I'm interested. But still, I already want to get the cards needed for that. We have more high scales than low scales. Smile Sorcerer, alright. Pendulum Sorcerer is better than Smile Sorcerer, so whatever. Super Rare, I know. Ultra Rare, maybe. Um, super Rare. It looks like Super Rare. I think I already got how it works with the... Where Sing is signing. Level 4, alright. Pendulum Storm, Oath Dragon. Oath Dragon is only a rare, so that's good. Oath Dragon is basically one of the best. Duelist Alliance, good. Okay, and last one of the 10. Yep. I guess it's Super Rare. Uh-huh. Oh, we get against Dance Princess of uh, Necros. Necros is also an option. Two low scales, important. And Chronograph Sorcerer, also important. So, okay. We found a new card pack. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And Counter Swing Mages again. And, okay. 120. Let's just duel a little more. I'm at... It's Right now it's 2 o'clock, 2.43, so I have a lot of time. I will just open all those notifications, just because, introducing some new features. This one about the shop, mm -hmm. and this one, because I don't want this to be building up. Steam gem gems purchase issue, regarding known issues, display Korean alphabet, okay, Korean Portuguese, okay. And that's finished, right? It will update soon enough. Okay. Lastly, missions. I get one more t 200 gems, I think. Okay. And by fifth, by purchasing 15, I am able to get one more. Okay. Solo again. I want to go for solo and play a little bit. I have opened a few gem, a few packs, and now we will finally go back to. The Wait, I have to change my deck a little bit. I won't put any pendulum deck, pendulum cards into this deck. None. But I have a lot. So, starting deck. Okay, edit the deck. Now I'm able to edit some cards. Yes, right click, drop. Okay, I now know how to. This works. About generating and dismantling decks. You access cards to gain CP crafting points according to the... Right, you are able to craft cards. So, we will just start off by doing this and... This. Ah, it looks way better. So, all the cards that I have, filters like this, 
filters. Okay, I want to have effect monsters. Uh, start off with effect monsters. Ultra rare, super rare, and okay. Red Dragon Ninja. On this card, you can banish one ninja. Okay, doesn't work. No pendulums, I said. Gazelle, Salaman Great Gazelle. Interesting. Dual Assembler. If this card is in your hand or graveyard, you can banish two other from your field. You know what? I said Link Monsters, so we will go for Cybers Monsters. Effect. So I want Cybers Monsters. Cybers. As soon as I see it, Cybers. Okay. I don't have enough right now for a full deck. I guess one of those. Rust Elijah. Full extra deck, you know it. And this should be fine, right? Oh, this one isn't in my position. I don't have enough of those. I guess this is all I'm able to do right now. Then let's check it like this. Normal monsters instead of effect monsters. Okay. Nothing. Super rare. Okay, I am still at that. Okay. Normal and effect monsters. I want to see all the monsters. Okay, one parallel exit. I will get sooner. I uh, get them soon enough. One more Salomon Great, Salomon Great Mia. Okay, Suppression Collider. All data crushed by this network. Okay, this card I already put it in. Launcher Commander. Okay, okay. I will just put it in everything that I have like this okay now get rid of all this go to filters card type where are my spells limited not forbidden okay summon enabled enabled disabled i have no idea what this means where are the spells okay normal spell field spell equip spell continuous spell quick play spell normal spell and counter spell field spell normal spell equip spell is gone continuous spell. like this I don't want Pendulum, no Pendulum, Frost Blast of a Monarch if you control 24 and 1000 defense. Target one card. Mm -hmm. Pretty boring. Let's see. Veil of Darkness. If you draw Dark Monsters, you can reveal them center, then you can draw one more card. Useful if you play long games, but am I playing enough Dark Monsters? I'm not playing enough Dark Monsters, so. Veil of Darkness isn't worth it yet, so I will put in two enemy controller, two twin twisters, two of those Phantom Knights Rusty uh, of Shade Brigandine, three of those, I have a good option of destroying a set cards, that's good. Link bound, target one link monster you control or in your graveyard, return it to the extra deck, and if you do draw cards equal to its link rating, then place cards from your hand to the bottom of the deck, equal to the number of cards, no. So, uh, spool code when an opponent's monster declares a direct attack while you. How's it going, Sharp Shaker Hawk? Um, it's going good. I'm just doing. Uh, I'm starting off with this. I'm starting off with the Master Duel and trying to build a good deck with this, which is a lot harder than you might think. At least a lot harder than I'm thinking. Especially with the uh, restriction of not putting in any Pendulum monsters. I basically already have my Pendulum deck ready. <laughs> uh. Nice. Did you already play this uh, or are you going to do this? What deck are you going for? Pendulum? <laughs> pendulum. Just Pendulum. No, I'm going for Pendulum soon enough, but currently I'm just going for a generic Link deck. Nothing special. And that's my goal. Right now I think this is a somewhat meh deck. Whatever, it's meh, so Rockets and Unchained. Okay. Okay, not bad. Okay, okay, not bad. I mean, you already see I only have 320 left. I'm almost done with both decks. Not bad. Oh, okay. You're not going for a merge type of deck, Unchained Rockets. Okay. For a second, I thought you meant that. Oh, are you able to customize your uh, your accessories? Oh, Ash Blossom Joy Springs. Nice. Um, yeah. Did you already pay into this game? <laughs> I am trying to go free to free for play, but uh, no, free to play. F free to play? Yes. So yeah, um, it's actually I already have a few things that I like about this game less than Duel Links because it has some animations that I don't like. It's a little slow right now. I think it could be faster, more optimized, but I, this might be just me going from different things. I used Rocket Tribal Gate. Okay. Did you use it in... What do you mean you used uh, 
And yes, I got Ash Blossom, and no, I didn't. And no, yes, I got Ash Blossom, and no, I didn't. I think this was a little too fast from me. Uh, I would recommend you buy the battle gem. Oh, ah, battle pass, it's a 600 gems. 600 gems? Oh, you are able to buy it with in-game money. Interesting. I did not know that, and this is going to change my uh, um, decision making. If you control, if your only opponent controls, you, know, you can. Okay, I don't have any extra deck monsters just yet, and I will end my turn. So that's a good recommendation. 600 gems. Right now, I already used up a lot of gems, so I do have to wait for that a, li a little bit. Okay, upstart goblin. Free upstart goblin. Okay, okay, okay. Setting, setting. I will use this effect, destroy this set part. And, yep. Good. Uh, oops, meant to say Unchained Tribal Gate. Oh, okay, okay. This does make more sense. Unchained Tribal Gate. Oh man, I never have tried out um, un, uh, Tri Brigade. Um, I'm, I tried out a lot of decks. That's annoying. No, I didn't want to. And the no I didn't was for I didn't pay yes. Okay, that one I figured out a little bit. You didn't pay yet. Okay. <laughs> and you can do solos and you will get enough to buy it. Yes, I know how to... Um, I already figured out how to get a lot of gems. But I still uh, increase this number of rank. Wait, 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 I will check. Yes, yes. Battle Pass increases number of rank matches. It does? Okay. I have to buy it. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. If I know how to... You're not able to battle as often as you want to? Interesting. I don't know what to think about that. And that's a really bad hand. Okay. I guess I only put this deck together in two seconds, so I guess that's what I get for this. I like the way they are looking, those cards. Uh, once per turn you can flip this card into face-up defense position. I will open the lock. Let's check. More incapacitor. Incapa okay, interesting. It's annoying that it's... wait, face down? Oh, okay. This card, once per turn one declares an attack, this card one monster. Okay, I don't have the cards needed. Okay. So, what do you think from of this game, Sharp J Hawk? I don't know what to think about it yet. I think it is a good game. It has a lot of potential. Uh, why am I attacking? And I would also recommend Ash Blossom. You get it for 750 and a few packs. Ash Blossom? Okay. Let's look into it after I am done with this battle, which is going to take a while. Okay. Tributing, okay, I will use one, do I already want to use it? I don't, but it's a guarantee blossom, okay, 750, I mean if you say it like that, you're buying, okay, it's pretty fun, okay, I also see that it's really, a, it has a lot of um, addiction potential, I would say, for me, I will love to play games like this, I mean, Yu-Gi-Oh, I love to play Yu-Gi-Oh. So, okay, first damage in this round. Okay, that's embarrassing. Okay, I don't know, you don't know what Ash, I know what Ash Blossom is. <laughs> I know that you are able to discard Ash, Ash Blossom to get your, your opponent from, uh, to prevent your opponent from drawing cards. Yes, I know that. <laughs> that would be embarrassing if not. You can tribute when target when, yeah, no, I don't want to do that. Um, I'm just, uh, I don't know where to, you get what. I didn't know Ash Blossom where you could get Ash Blossom from. <laughs> uh, okay. Sorry, I was a little uh, annoyed by the question. Also, I love the fact that Ash Blossom isn't in Duel Links because I'm playing Pen, basically. Um, that's just me. Okay, whatever. Now we have this set card again. Draw Dual Assemblum, okay. If this card is used in your hand, you can banish two from your hand and or face up from your field. Special summon, but it's an attack. Yeah, I don't care. Okay. What cards are in this game or what cards are already available to, for players? I did not figure that one out yet. So, yeah. Battle uh, and battle. Oh, you saw the Ash Blossom pet? 
Crash Cross and Pet. I saw accessories. And was this a pet or were you able to buy Ash Blossom with this? Um, oh, you saw the Ash Blossom pet. Yeah, I think, yeah, I don't know. Just go to the other side and there will be a pet. I think I'm getting a few too many information. I need to calm down and... You know what? I'm going to do this after I'm done. This is going to be the last turn. So, I'm able to do it. Face up attack position right here. Duel a Samworm. Kill my opponent. I want to fight, but its attack are halved. Okay. Read more cards. Annoying. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ah, uh, okay. I have to calm down. Tribute this card, which is, which is already annoying me. Get this. And attack, please. Let's me just check where everything is. I was able to finish this card. Just go to the other side and there will be a pack. Okay. Let's see. A little level, yeah, complete. I got Monster Reborn, which is good. Now, solo mode, right here. Shop. Shop is loading. I was at accessories. Structure deck and pack. Normal pack, secret pack, bonus pack, special, dual pass, go. 600. Okay, now I know what you mean, I will get that. Next, Ash Blossom, this was what I saw. I won't click on it, but do I want to click on it? Because dual field icon. Yeah, I will have to buy, uh, spend so much right here. Uh, <laughs> okay. okay, go to the other side. First of all, I will stock up on gems right here. All, all rewards at once, 10 gems. This one unlimited. Specials, oh, specials, okay. 100, um, shop, specials, specials, bundle, build, special, bundle, okay, 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 one per player, you are able to guarantee, get a guaranteed, okay, I get what you mean, lightning storm, a bundle, okay, and solemn judgment, okay, what cards are included in this pack, just out of, out of here, okay, 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 get it. 750, I need to grind it a little bit. Okay. Okay. I knew it wasn't a good idea to already spend all my gems at once, but I... Yeah, I needed to do this because... Yeah. Because. Then, is this the one where you get the most? That was 100 rare CP. Okay. Uh... Good. 100 rare card points, I think. You can use them to craft rare cards. Right now, I don't really want to do that yet, because I don't know... I, I'm too much. I don't even know whether or not... I, I, I know that I will go for... Um, that I will go for... First of all, I know that I will go for Pen. Everyone knows that I will go for Pen. But the problem is... Um, I don't want to do that in the beginning, because that would be boring. So right now, edit deck. First of all, that. So... Put this one in, get rid of all the... I have to get rid of so much right now. Uh, like this. I already got a uh, parallel exit, by the way. You can use them to... Yeah, I already saw it. Okay. So. Four free. And... That's good enough. Effect monsters, normal monsters. Okay. Good old strategy with... Um, no attack. Other attack one. This one. Okay. No pendulum cards. I am not allowed to do this. If this card is special, if uh, this card can attack you, you can tribute, you can... Okay, it's just a generic one, I guess. This one, free off. This one I want to, but no pendulum cards, I said. You can target one, you, you cannot sparrow summon, uh-huh. Then get free of those, it's just generic. Generically okay. Magna rocket. I want to go for the rockets. Currently I have only one rocket basically. Oh wait, I'm I should do this differently. Put in two of those. This parallel seed can go away. This card can go away. And am I able to search by card text? Okay. Rocket. Two Magna Rockets and that's all. Okay. Yeah, that's still not good enough. So, okay. 
so. Okay, well, let's just get fill this up. Yep, yep, yep. I won't even read them. And okay, next I need to get a few more. I don't want any good deck. This is just a deck for a story mode, basically. Um, trap cards, trap cards, normal trap. Okay. I have a lot of um, normal trap. Um, okay. Okay. I have a lot of this, two of those. I already have three, okay. Um, this one, Wall of Disruption. Two off. Okay. Now please let me have a good core. This should be enough. This is dismantle and generate. Okay, now I know what you're talking about. Oh I I mean I had an idea of what you were talking about. So okay. Normal rare okay. Anyway, save and return. Story here aren't like dual links. I did see that it wasn't the same. They aren't easy to beat with oh I mean, I'm not at the point where they are. Right now they are pretty easy, but I think if I get to that point, I will directly switch to a good deck. For now, I'm still in the beginning, so I don't think I will see anything big happen. But I guess, okay, so they are actually, okay, they are actually difficult to beat. That's interesting. Okay, and I also want to see whether or not my opponent is knows how to play, how good the AI is. So now this is making me excited. Set, set, and set, and in attack position. Is this is accept Magara Rocket? Special summon, yep, accept, so I'm not able to use its effect yet. Main phase, draw phase, main phase, going to go for Digrapha. Going to go for United We Stand, okay. Chain this one, and confirm. I like this chain animation. I already like this chain animation. I love this chain. Yep, okay, okay. Yep, I know. And this one. Okay. Legendary Sword. He's playing equip spells. Okay. Effect activation. Uh, use this one. Okay. And confirm. Chain. Yep. And in defense position. Yes, I could have waited until my opponent did all his stuff. Oh. Okay, the AI right now doesn't seem to be that good. Oh wait, that was actually pretty pretty smart. Okay, I did not think of that. Okay, 2000 Call of the Haunted. Okay, with this deck I might actually have a problem with beating it. I have a Link Spider, but that's actually the worst thing I could probably do right now. What does my extra deck have? I have this, I have two plus effect monsters, I don't have enough effect monsters. Nope. But I have a level 4 Kachikochi. Is Kachikochi good enough? Kachikochi is at 21, so no. No, no. Already I see what you mean. Okay, okay. Um, then I guess attack position. Because my cards don't have enough defense, I guess that's it. I did not expect this to happen. Okay. Um... Yes, one more. I will activate this effect of game controller. I thought about doing this. Okay, maybe I should have just let him do this. Okay, I'm already not that good. Okay, 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 okay. I say I know that I'm saying okay a lot. Yes. So, start off with Link Spider. Confirm. And go for this Link. Okay. Next one. I'm able to special summon this card. No, 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 I don't want to proceed to the battle phase. I know this doesn't change too much, but still. Yep. Then I have the option of going for Link Freeze in theory. I could go for this Gaia, which is at 2600 attack. What do I also have? I have Gaia, I have Rasta Legia. Two plus monsters except tokens. You can target one Link. This card. Okay. I think the best option right now is Gaia, I think. Gaia, two plus monsters. So. Yep, special summon Gaia. Select, confirm, confirm, and confirm. Yeah, I'm still playing. Okay. Lightning, yep, Gaia, the lightning, whatever. Sword, I guess. Call of the Haunted, Haunted now. And I want to go for, I think, this one because it's getting buffed by the 
but it's called Sogan. Okay. It's actually the Japanese name. Interesting. Okay. Um, now Gaia. Kill. Okay. Okay. I like the animations. That's good. I like them a lot. Next one. Main phase one. End phase. Okay. Now it's getting going a little faster. Okay. Next chosen by the world chalice. Attack. Okay. Attack. And attack. And do some. Okay. Call of the Haunted. Okay. I will still crash into it because I want this card gone. Do some damage. Okay. Also, why is there a rabbit? What? Okay, I guess this is my opponent. This is Rescue Rabbit in his uh, downtime. In his downtime, he's playing Yu Gi Oh! and being this guy. Okay, I could also, I think, kill my. Wait, can I kill my opponent? 26, uh, uh, 4600. Nope, that wouldn't make any difference. So let's just go to attack. This is also a machine. Why is Gaia a machine? I guess because it's a uh, Ling. Uh, whatever. Lightning Shadow. No, I would have preferred him being a warrior, but whatever. So, next one. Finish quickly, please. The machine. The A forces. Okay. End phase. Alright. I'm not even caring about Heavy Storm Blustering him. My turn, attack, and please finish. Attack. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll have to ride a little bit. Okay, this changes a little bit. Surprisingly, my opponent really did play a lot of things that were surprisingly good. I was really surprised. Surprisingly. Okay. The uh, Marmotin Captain, when this card is normal summon, you can shuffle Wong, then draw a card, then you can shuffle. That's pretty alright for now. And free of, so. If I'm playing a monster heavy deck, it's basically a free special summon. When this card is summ uh, special summon, normal summoned, you can special summon one card from your hand, basically. If I play very few spells and traps. Okay. Anyway, next one. Monster, skill successor, heavy storm duster. Alright, heavy command. Okay, okay, okay. Wall of Disruption, good start. Setting two cards. I will go for this card, this warrior monster, and go for the attack. Uh, this is going to take a while until I have all the things that I need. Oil Man? Was this Oil Man? No, Magical Undertaker. Because it had the same, whatever. Whatever. Okay. That's all right. And this is copycat. Interesting. Okay, Book of Secret Arts. Battle phase. Damage step. Hello? Damage step? When an opponent declares an attack. Okay, this one is on a attack duration. Okay. Whatever. Okay, okay. New control once per turn. This is a 2k sir. Um, then I guess I will do this one here. I will activate this effect to the effect one okay enemy controller change it to defense position yep and normal sum this is not a this is a cyber small event target okay whatever there doesn't stand a and accept this one gain 300 attack and defense you can tribute when target one whatever whatever take it go with it wall of disruption i understand now how it works setting one card okay Slowly but surely, we do get back into this game. I'm really used to just pendulum summoning and doing my thing, so it's weird to have to think about what my opponent does, to be honest. Yes, that's a very weird uh, thing to say. I know that for most people. For me, it, I'm just saying what I think. So, drawing one card. Interesting. Nice. So, nice. Let's go for the attack. 1800. And where do you get the most things? You can use them to craft story arms. Whatever. Where do you get most gems? That's the thing that I will find out soon enough. He's going to go for another book of secret arts. I am able to use spear successor in the battle damage steps, so that's good. Battle phase. Yep. Oh, 2300. This one is at. Okay, I have to use wall of disruption now. And it goes down to 1500. Yep. Um, damage step? Nope. 
And 300 damage. Okay. Main phase 2, end phase. Yep. And we will go for the next one. Phantom Knights of Shade Brigandine. I have that card and I will use that card. Not now, but one day. Because I just used the uh, skill description, I'm not able to use it. So, whatever. Attack. And next turn, my opponent is probably going to die, I think. I might just use skill disruption on my opponent's turn to get more if of its effect with 800 attack boost. Yes, that's an option, but no, I don't think so, because that's a little dangerous if you think about it. More spell destruction, I don't want that. So, okay, I will go for Kachi Kochi. I also want to see the animation of that. Oh, my recording is already at... Oh no, it's already at 50 minutes. I forgot that... Ah. Okay, you know what? Um, yeah, I will do this battle. Then I have to definitely split this one into two halves. That's going to be annoying. Whatever. Okay. Mystic Hunter. I don't have enough attack to kill it, I think. Nope. So, yeah. That's annoying. He has another one of those. So, okay. Skill Successor. Wait, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. I'm an idiot. Because I... Because he did some stuff. Yep. Ah, uh, okay. Whatever. Okay. I still have skill successor in my graveyard, which is good. He's going to try to crash, and I think I have to allow it. Now he's going to attack me directly. Okay. I am really uh, posing, giving off a very bad figure right now. Why am I making so many mistakes? Uh, yes, and yes. Destroy. Go away. So, I have to basically draw anything. Launch a commander is good enough. Okay. Good. Attack. Attack. And I don't think I have another Kachikochi, which is why I did not do anything with this launcher commander. And turn. Okay. Uh, I have to do something more, a little a little faster, so I need to... Battle Wars, yeah, I have that one too. Special Summon, yeah, nice. Anyways, we were able to finish this battle off, and then I have to um, close off a recording and open a new one, because it's easier to have many different uh, recordings that are, clear, that are slower, no, that are shorter. So, for the YouTube viewers, have a nice day and goodbye!